Well, hello there, guys. It's 17 Crash here, and it's time to continue our season here with the Chicago Blackhawks. Year three. Uh, yeah. So, we left off with a 4 to 3 loss versus Detroit. So, we're just gonna I'll put Brock Bogard back in the net here. We are gonna get those two games done, and hopefully, we can get up to like the All Star break or, yeah. Something like that, something like that in this video. And um, we're gonna check out the stats and everything when we get to the All Star break. So, yeah, we're just gonna keep simulating. I'm working through this a little bit faster. We get one to four loss. Fuck. That's not good. Let's see here. Bounce back with a win. Bounce back with a win. Come on, Brock Bogard. Yeah, it bounces back. He bounces back. Now it's Toronto. Toronto Maple Leafs. Who actually looks like they will make the playoffs this year. So it's like, that was a pretty long time ago. Come on. Beat their asses. Now we lose three to four. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Let's get Corey Schneider back in the net. Fuck. We don't want to start the slump in here. You know, we just want to move. We want to keep going, keep going, and keep going. We're going to be a powerhouse. We want to be a powerhouse. So bounce back here with a win over Columbus Blue Jackets. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yeah, two to one win. Two to one win. That's great. That's what I like about having two good goaltenders. You know, you can just swap them. And I, I, I actually think that it works. That it works. You know, even though injuries is off and everything, but I believe that if you swap a swap a goaltender, just once in a while, it, it'll, it'll just give it like, give it, give the goaltender a break when he comes back and he's focused and he's good to go. So that's what I like about this. Let's see here. And it looks like Schneider has been yeah, he's been doing good good now two wins in a row. Let's just keep it up and get a third. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, it's lost. Six to two. Ah crap. Come on, bounce back, bounce back, bounce back. <laughs> Fucking Edmonton Oilers. <sighs> come on, Ed. come on, come on. Yeah, we went through it. Three to two. Just gotta keep it up, you know? We don't wanna win two and lose two. We wanna. At least we want to get like three to two. That's not good, but it's better than two to two. Hopefully, we can go up to like maybe like four to two. That's really what I'm talking about. Now we're up four to one. Four to one, four to one. Uh, can we get five to one for Schneider? Would be nice. Would be nice. Come on. It's got to get it. Speed it up a little bit here. This is what it's all about. This is what it's all about. Come on. Now it's time for Nashville. Now it's time for Nashville. 
Can we get up to 5 to 1? Five to one this time around. Yeah, five to one. Let's keep it up. Keep it up. You know, as long as we, if we can keep twice as many wins as losses, it will be great. And that's yeah. If we get this when we're exactly like two to one. That's what I want to keep. I want to have a two to one win loss ratio. Will be then will be just fine. So come on. Yeah, great. Oh, we got one more game. Then we're two to one. So let's just get a win over Kings. Schneider is six to one this time around. That's great. That's great for Schneider. <sighs> no, it's time. Come on. Kings has had a good year. Or they're having a good year. 26, 15, and 1. Oh, we, get an we get another win. That's great. That's great. So it's back to back games. With Kings. So now we're at the 2 to 1 ratio. And this is the way I want to keep it. But everybody knows it's gonna be a losing streak. Just gonna be, we're gonna lose a couple of more games. You know, the losing streak is always coming. And there's a loss. So gotta get Schneider out of there. He's six to two, so that's great. Bugard is getting back in the net. Let's see if he can bounce back here with a win. Would be sweet. Would be sweet. But we all know it's all co it all comes down to the playoffs, you know. Any team can win in the playoffs. It's always fun when you have a good year, but it's the playoffs that matters. Come on. So it's Nashville next time. Uh, all right, all right. We could use a win here. Bouncing back, bouncing back. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, fuck. Come on. Come on. What are you waiting for? No, it's a loss. Fuck. Three to nothing, all right. That's bad. Come on, we gotta speed it up. Three to nothing, win. That's great. He bounces back with a shout out. That's good for Bogard. So let's keep it up. Keep it up. Keep it up. We don't want to be one to two. He doesn't want to be one to two. Come on, beat San Jose. Now we lose three to two. Fuck. It's an overtime loss, but anyway. So Bugard only went one to two now. So he gets get Schneider back in the net here. I don't know what's the problem with this fucking loading screen is, you know, it always takes a shitload of time, it shouldn't be that hard, I haven't changed that much. <sighs> no, thank you. So let's go here, let's get these two games done. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want any offers anyway, so. 
Come on now. Just get it done. Just get it done. Just get it done. Can Corey Schneider bounce back with a win now? Can he bounce back with a win now? Uh, come on. Uh, no! This is probably our slump. Now we gotta bounce back. We gotta bounce back. Come on. No, it was three to nothing. Yeah. This is this is probably our losing streak of the year. At least I'm hoping for that. So this is not what it's going to be for the rest of the season. Then I'm going to be pretty disappointed. But we'll just have to wait and see. Come on, Abu Guard. Bounce back here. It's your time to shine. Bounce back and, and win a couple of games. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm standing up now. Come on. Uh... Bounce back. That's good. That's good. Let's just keep it up. Keep it up. Keep it up. Ah. Coffee is just so nice. It's just so nice. Makes you feel like a king. Come on. Keep it up, keep it up, yeah, great, keep it up. And now we're just gonna get a win over Rangers, then we're gonna another winning streak. That's exactly what we wanna do. But they had a good year. Oh my god, they had a good year. No! <sighs> Fuck. Come on, bounce back, bounce back. Gonna be a tough team to beat, Rangers. How's Lindback doing? They had like a tweener year, and we'll lose another one, two to one, for fuck's sake. <sighs> it was looking good there for a while, but fuck. Then we'll lose two in a row. Well, now we're just back where we left off. <laughs> Crap. Crap, 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 crap. So we're at the all-star break now. All right, all right. We're just going to keep it going. We're just going to keep it going. We don't, so there's a lot of time left, so we can, may, might just be able to get, get it down to the trade deadline instead. And that would be even, even better. Then we can wrap. Then we can just wrap this season up. We're just gonna check out the season stats and where we are, where we are, and all that in the next video. No, not in the next video, but when we just simulate it up to the next game after the All Star break here. Come on! I don't want to play the All Star break. Let's just see here. Let's just see here. Stop the simulation. I don't know what's going on. What are you simulating? Thank you. So let's just check out the team standings a little quick. Chicago 62 was second in the Western Conference. Yeah, we're gonna go into that later on. Goals and assists. Julian is third in the NHL. That's good for Julian, you know. Yes, I, I knew he was gonna have a good year. And the assists, no one there. All right, guess that's all right. 
points and wins. We got Drew in on 52 points. Just a little bit behind Tavares and Giroud, Herbele and Nuge. Yeah, Ovechkin. Alright. Wins. Got no one there. Save percentage. No one there. Goals against. No one. Yo, Bogard is still number four. Alright, that's good. That's good. Right, let's just go into the stats central a little bit quick. Uh, she got the team standings. So we're eighth in the NHL right now. Even though Los Angeles is sad, like, yeah, seven more games than us, but all right. Guess that's it. that's just what it's supposed to be now. Check out the goals four per game. We are eighth in the NHL. And goals four. Goals against. We are third in the NHL. That's good. That's great. That's great. Uh, power play, 21, we're second in the NHL, it's only Edmonton, it's a little bit better, and in our PK is 85, so we're ninth in the NHL in PK, alright, 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 let's just keep it going. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I can get these two games done. Yeah, one to nothing win, that's good. It bounces back here. Well, a shout out, Corey Schneider. That's great, that's great. Uh, 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 uh. Let's keep it up, let's keep it up. We've got to get a couple of wins now. I want to be in the top. We'll lose four to three. That's not good at all. Come on, come on. Bounces back with a win. That's great. That's great. That's great. Columbus Blue Jackets. Columbus Blue Jackets. Can we keep it up? Come on, come on. Yeah, a shout out for Schneider. Great, great. <laughs> Nick Laddie is our greatest plus player. 14. Wasn't that great, but all right. Come on, no, we lose three to four, fuck's sake. Blue guards back behind the net, back behind the net, back in the net. Come on now, come on now, this goddamn loading screen. Fuck. So, it's Anaheim now, alright, alright. Beat their asses, beat their asses. Come on, come on. Uh, yeah, it's a win. Five to two, great, great. And now it's Vancouver Canucks. <sighs> another win would be fine. I'd be actually quite happy with one, with another win. Come on. No! <sighs> For fuck's sake. And it's the Oilers. It's the Oilers, alright? Can we beat the Oilers? I'm hoping for it. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. That 
that's just fucking pathetic. Oh my god. Well, screw this. We're gonna check out the player stats for this season. That was not a good loss. <sighs> my god. Alright, so we got Jonathan Drew in here on 61 points in 57 games. So he's having, he's having a great year. Taves 52 points in 57 games. And Paris say 49 points in 57 games. I don't know what's going on here. Hmm. Ribeiro 37 points. Shinkrook 36. And Patrick Kane 35. Let's see here then. Glennon has got 16 points. It's, it's got to be that power play. Morin, Sauter, and Norris McKinnon, 12. All right. 15, 14, and 12 on the third line. Uh, Hayes, Fair, and Kruger. Kruger's got six points on the fourth line. That's not great. Ugh. So, goaltenders. I can pursue defensemen. Doug and Keith, and Eric Johnson, and Glennoning. All right. Let it call in the sea. But yeah, that's pretty pretty decent. So got Bogard and Schneider, they're pretty equal in the goals against there. Shootout losses. Save percentage. Schneider's a little bit better. He's supposed to be a little bit better, so that's just no problem with that. Yeah. Guard has more shout outs, but yeah, anyways, anyway, 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 anyway. So we're just gonna leave it with that three to seven loss versus fucking Oilers. And that's gonna be all for now. So I'm just gonna say thank you guys for watching, and I will see you around.